Welcome back. So to start, we are going to use some thyme. We are going to use some oregano. We are also going to use some chili. It's optional. We are going to also use some paprika and of course some cayenne pepper. We're going to add some red pepper flakes, but that is also optional. And holy smoke, that is also optional as well. You don't need to, but I like the taste that it gives in the recipe. We're going to use some Old Bay. And we are going to use some white pepper. Some freshly grind black pepper. Some must-haves are the following. Some garlic powder, onion powder, and of course, we're going to have some salt. You need some salt. Some recipes would call for some mustard, dry mustard, but today I'm going to grind my own mustard and I'm going to use that grind mustard in this recipe. So the ingredients that are optional in this recipe are as follows. The mustard powder, the holy smokes, the pepper flakes, but I like a little heat, even though we are already adding white pepper and black pepper, and the chili powder. These in ingredients are optional. They are not in the original recipe. So if you want the original Cajun seasoning taste, you will omit these recipes, these ingredients that I just mentioned, and you will just stick to the original ingredients that was given. You will also be required to add some celery salt, but I am not using any celery salt today. I choose to omit that. So then in the original recipe, you will have cayenne pepper, you will have thyme, oregano, paprika, cayenne pepper, white pepper, black pepper, salt, and Old Bay. So are we ready to put these ingredients together and create our Cajun seasoning? Yes, we are. So let's get started. So, all of the measurements would be in the description below. As I put all of the ingredients together, I just want to take this time to let you know to look out for the following recipe. That would be my Cajun chicken that I did on my tabletop grill. It was really moist and delicious. So make sure and look out for that. So... I choose was to use the mustard seed because the dry mustard or mustard powder really hard to get at this particular point so I choose was to grind up what I had which was the mustard seed and it worked really well. And as I previously mentioned the following recipe that will be coming three days after this video is premiered would be this upcoming Cajun chicken. So this is what my Cajun seasoning look like. As I said, if you want the original recipe to omit certain ingredients that was given or what I put into this. And this is what it looks like up close. And that's how easy I made this Cajun seasoning. Thanks so much for watching. Kendall's Corner.